are right. So we're back at. Let's get back over here. Thank you. We are back at inside the night's trial. Um, everyone has met a few traps. Um, a lot of doors. And the last time we were together, Avilios ran into the room with a couple of goblins. And just to let you know, because of your role last time, um, Nephrite, uh, you saw the the red squares where the traps, where the poison yep. dart trap is there. So I painted them for you. And Thank so, you. So right now it is um, Gwen's turn. And from the last time, Gwen, um, Alicia suggested that you, you and Aerith go back to try to find the rest of the group. What do you do? Eh, go back. Because I do not want to face any more monsters alone. Okay, so when you're ready, move your character. All right, I can move up to a total of 60. Thanks to the dash action. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's been a while, so I'm going to have to check. 45 would be up to a leash, and 60 would be just around the corner. Got it. That's my turn. Okay, then. Up next is Dezo. And wait, I thought... I, wait, I thought I had... I could make a triple movement. Yep, yep bonus you, action for... Yep. Uh, oh, yeah, right. bonus, yep, bonus action, dash. Um, I can... I will allow that ne this time, but next time I am not... No, nope, reminding you. You gotta remember these things. I... Hey, I so usually do. I usually do. It, I usually do at Blaine Fart. Right. Sorry. So it is Dezo's turn, and she is going to use a bonus action to transform herself, I like this feature, into her wolf form. And Magic Weapon is still on her, so... Claws are still magic. Yeah. And so she is going yep. to run up to this guy and take a, a bite. Now I need to get that sheet. Nineteen will hit a piercing and a strength saving throw from the zombie, please. <laughs> it's a cool, not a zombie. There's a difference. Sorry, sorry, my apologies. It failed the. I definitely failed the, uh. The strain. So it is knocked prone. Yikes. Talk and, about a hard thing. And what other, um, uh, one did you save? Wisdom for the, the magic claws? Uh, no. What? Her claws are magical thanks to magic weapon. I have to focus on that because it's a concentration spell. Yeah, but she but... Bite, bites, so that would not work. Yeah, sadly. Okay. So that's or... good. 
So that it's gonna. The idea end. is coming around to me. I'll mention it. I'll mention it. I'll mention it later. All right. No, you're up. Okay. I'm gonna do it again. Switch it over. Moving thirty, and since ah, oh, you know what the heck with it. I'm going to and some extra damage, and oh, there it goes. And he's going to point towards this spot, and he's going to hold out his hold out his palm upwards, and he's going to pull out as he pulls it upwards. He shouts, "Pummeling second bullet!" And he casts. Snillock Snowball Swarm at level 2. Nice. So, so both ghouls have to make a dexterity save. Yep. Here's ghoul number 1. Half damage. And ghoul number 2. Oh. Half damage! It is a net 22! Come on! Yep, so so where are, you, where are you throwing it? Like, over here, you said? Yeah, r right here, so that it, it affects it with any... So within five feet, so him and him. Yep. Why didn't you just put it in the middle of all three of them? Because it's only a five foot radius. Hey, wait. Uh, Smack dab in the middle, so right here. So, yeah, yeah it would be. No, yeah. yeah, this square. Yeah. Square right so, here, so, it, yep, like that. That's actually the best option. Kill two birds with one snow. Well, two birds with one <laughs> snowball. Oh, Did you no. say snow, really? <laughs> no, I was about to say two birds with one stone, then I had to change it and say, hang on, wait, this is a snowball. <laughs> two birds with one snowball. Uh... Do I have regrets okay, for uh, that? It yes. It turns over. Alright. That turns over Nephrite. I am not going to block his line of sight, so I am going to move my happy little self about same area as Null. Would you mind, since magic weapon is a bonus action, can I shift concentration for a second? Uh, depending on what you're doing. Shifting the concentration for magic weapon from her from Dezos' claw to her jaw. I would say that would be a bonus action, yes. Because AKA magic teeth. <laughs> I would say that would be a bonus action to do that, yes. Perfect. So bonus action for a magic weapon, shifting the concentration from Dezos' claws to her teeth. So her teeth, whenever she bites, gets a plus one. Mm -hmm. To both attack and damage. Yep. And on the same wavelength of damage. I see what my buddy is trying to do. I have one spell that I never use, but yet I need to be within a close range, and that is suicide. Why? Right, what kind of spell is it? Poison spray. However, I need to be within 10 feet of the targets. Oh yeah, that's suicide, especially for a character like yours. So, classic. Why did it not go? Okay. Blah, blah, blah. There we go. Yep, I don't know why up. every time I click... Yep. yep to... to that guy? Yep. Okay. Hey, freezer burn! <laughs> uh, why? And that's all you're doing? Uh, yeah, because I can't really do much with Zuri. Oh, wait! I can. Have Zuri fly. If I need to put back on the ruler, I shall. Oh, that is just uncannily perfect. What are you doing? 
Zarya's actually gonna fly right here to the corner. So that way Quinn can see him. Just as a little marker. And now with that, I end my turn. Alright, then it is Aerith's turn. And she is not gonna do that much. She's just going to pretty much catch up to Gwen. Use turn for movement, action, and bonus action to run. Now it's the monster's turn. So first off, we're going to have this ghoul here attack the Philios. He is AFK at the moment. Of course he is. Alright then, we'll start with the ghoul attacking Dazel then. Oh jeez. That's a hit, unfortunately. Why are these guys so weak, yet they hit like a truck? No, take a look at the damage, the duality of the dice. It's a 2d4, she, the ghoul got a 4 and a 1. Yep. Oh. The duality of the dice. Yep, and Dezo... Needs to make a constitution save, but it's gotta be in the wolf form, so I'm not sure how that's gonna work. Oh! Uh, I accidentally did an advantage. It's supposed to be normal, and it's and she failed. Dang it. Yep, so she is paralyzed for one minute. No, bye. It's gonna add. And Avelius is back. Just attack for the ghoul to attack him. That is evil. Yeesh. Yeesh. I've if only he... been back for two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> if I may. Oh, yes. uh, uh, I don't think there's not hit. If I may. Yeesh. If his breath, if the ghoul's breath really is that bad, he really needs to blush. It's a claw attack. It's a claw attack, sadly. Dang it. An 18 doesn't the, hit. The 18 doesn't no, hit? That was for Dezo, wasn't it? No, oh wait, shoot, the, again? No, the first one was for Dezo, the second one over here is for Velios. And I need to... Do a little something here. Yeah, if I do that. Nope, nope. AC's a 19. Yep. How the heck is your AC a 19? This one's going over here, here to attack. Attack Avilios um, again. 16 from Chainmail, 2 from Shield, 1 from my Finding Style. Yep. Ah, that explains it. Ah, uh, oh! well. Oh, oh jeez. So what am I making? Um, you're taking 13 damage, and you need to roll a constitution, a constitution saving throw. All right, 13 damage, and then a con save. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Well, that works. I just go to get dinner, and this is the shit, I, or the crap I come back to. Sorry. Now you know how I feel. Oh, oh dang it. Yeah. Oh. I love it here. <laughs> okay, so Emilios is also paralyzed for one minute. Wait, 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 wait. You need to do another constitution save. Oh, Bless. right. Bless. Uh. At least the DC is low is 13. <laughs> No. No. You wanna replace that? Gavilio, no offense. Gavilios and I... Dazel are paralyzed. And so, I'll what, take what, away and... the less. Yeah. And the Paralyze worst part is, like uh, taken, anyone yeah. gets hit with when they're paralyzed, it's an automatic crit. What's it called? Um, paralyzed just means I can't take any actions, right? 
Yep. Yep. For one wow. minute. For one yeah. minute, but but you can't do uh, saving throws at, at each turn to try to fight off the paralyzation. Okay. Oh. Okay. Well, this ain't gonna end well. Oh, uh, wait. Oh. Yeah? I'm gonna put in that one and then that 20 counter. Blech. Next up is uh, Bilios, is um, Alicia's turn. He's Alicia. Yep. Yeah, um, and he's just also going to, at this point, uh, run. He ran away, Alicia. If nobody got that song, I swear to God, as a music, as a music nerd, you all will be disowned. Yeah. I don't know what, sigh. Yep, so that's no. seven, so that's seventy. The song was Runaway Baby by Bruno Mars. Yeah, I don't know that. Fair enough. Okay. Okay, so a leash is running past uh Aris. Missouri? Yep, and hearing Zuri squawk. Ah, uh, just let me do this for one moment. Nope, he has not stepped on, on the trap yet. Oh, thank God. But that is everything. Uh, Vilios, make the, the, co the co constitution save. Don't worry, guys, I'm 0 for 2 today. What could be wrong? Really? Yeah, I... You just there jinxed we it. <sighs> there we go. Unfortunately, that this does take your your action to do that. Um, um does that take my? It takes the whole turn, doesn't it? <coughs> Not just my action. Yeah, it does. Okay. So now number seven, Quinn, you're up. All right. I think I have enough move to at least get to the trap area. You, sixty would have put you right behind a leash. Seventy-five would put you right on the trap, so you would have triggered it. Or you can uh, uh, use some of your movement to jump. Uh, the thing is, he doesn't know about the trap. Oh, no one's ever told him yet. Yeah, I thought I, I, thought I told him. You told him about the trap, not where the trap is. Oh shoot! So. Make a dexterity save, please, Gwen. You fool, you fell for the most obvious of blunders. Seriously, poison one of uh, you know what, I'm showing sure up. Come on, lucky. Hey! Yeah, Dang no, it. I was it doesn't matter about, about the damage of the trap, you easily see the dart coming and you dodge out of the way. Dang it, I was hoping I would get hit by it to show off my poison resistance. I think all of us have poison resistance because of the mark. Mm-hmm. Uh, actually, he adds it naturally. Oh, yeah! Wait, what? Oh, right. Experiment. I was about yep. to say, wait, Drow don't have that experiments to do. Yep. Now it's Dazel's turn, and she has to make the the save. No. Nope. She's still paralyzed. Okay, you know what? This is gonna be a breeze. No? Really? You're cool. Alright. So, why the heck not? I'm gonna just move for just another five feet, and... Targeting this guy, I will be a frost him. Just gotta. And thanks again for that little arcane focus enhancement. You're welcome. Yep. Gotta what can I say that... except you're welcome? 16. Because oh, but... of, uh, because of Bless, too. Oh, but... No, Bless would have been removed yep. because yeah, bless... of Elio's. Oh yeah. right. Yeah, so because thirteen. Yeah. yeah. Um which guy again, Is sorry? 
Which one? Oh, um... That guy? The one... The, this guy, yeah. The one, the one I'm circling. Yeah, the one south of Avalius. He did. So... Good. Oh, and so... I'm just... I'm gonna spend... Uh, move another 10 feet and... Right here. And end turn. I got I to it that spot! <laughs> <laughs> if you want to, uh, well, well yeah, you can well, always go well, up here. Oh, wait. Like, oh, five. Okay, so that's perfect. Never mind. Okay. And but you might be affected. Voice. Give me a sec. I gotta, I gotta rethink everything so that way I don't get you as well. So if I move 25, 10, 10, I think no matter where I go, you will be affected. Oops. If you don't want, if you don't mind if I take a risk, I'm going to need to. So I'm going to move 25 feet from where I was to here. Please, by the Lord, let this spell work, because this is the first time I've used it. Wait, I thought the spell was too dangerous to use. It is, but this is a this is actually an AOE that might affect all that might affect the last two. Actually, wait, wait mm -mm. doesn't he have poison resistance? That's why I'm saying I might need to take this risk. I think all of us do. Not a lot, but it's still a DC 16 constitution save from the ghouls, and sadly also null. Oh, it's only uh, one target. One target, really? Yeah, it's yeah, a one target spell. Sure. Oh, shoot, okay. Uh, then I will make it on the one that still has Dezo under freaking paralyzation. Kinda wish you could have gotten a higher spell, a higher number for the, for the attack wall. It's not an attack, but yeah, I understand where you're coming from when it comes down to damage. It's only a d12. Yeah, but still, though, a total would have been 24 for both. So it's 5 poison damage. If uh, he fails on the save. I'll roll just for kicks. Unfortunately, you... It takes the damage, but it's not poisoned. Takes the damage, but not for all that is holy freaking curse you, Mistra. Hey, that's my goddess you're talking about. My apologies. We are. Oh wait, can she actually hear me? <laughs> I'm gonna say you yelled loud enough that Aerith could hear you through the earring. Okay, I'll take that. My apologies, we are dealing with two remaining ghouls, and dumb little old me forgot one little bitty information about ghouls. They are Damn. resistant to poison. Oh, oh, yeah. Actually, I've reread those ghoul sheet. Unfortunately, it doesn't even take the damage. Never mind, not resistant. They are bloody immune. <laughs> So they don't even take the, so they don't even take poison damage from your sharp tongue. I may be victoriolic, but not even that kind of poison would down these guys. And sadly, I'm not a bard, so I can't cast vicious mockery. Although that would be lovely at this point in time. Reaction of Elias <laughs> just rounds of applause. <laughs> oh come on! I thought that was a Shut good joke. <laughs> All right. Anything else, Ethnephrite? Sadly, no. That is all that I can do because I thought that would work, but apparently these guys are freaking immune to poison because flipping undead! Yep, so it's Aerith's turn and she's gonna use her movement, action, and bonus action to go right here. And I gotta... Can she grab Zuri as well? Because I kind of forgot. 
I forgot to move him. Can she? Can she yep. Zuri? Okay. Yep. She'll grab. She'll grab Zuri. I'll. I'll allow Thank that you. since we did the. Since we did that thing, but now Aerith's got to make her dexterity save. And she passes. That's good. Everybody in the party got a higher dex than that right in the Velios. Both of us just looking. We are surrounded by nimble people. Mind you, I was kind of born from the Hefty commercial, so it's no brainer that I'm not nimble. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be fair. Fair, most of us have been put through situations where we needed to be nimble. That is also fair anyway. It is still Aerith's turn. I just have to make that joke. Well, it is true. And also, I just realized I put myself in a dangerous situation. I might get hit. I think it's Aerith's turn. Oh no, it's the monsters. It's the monsters. It's the mon I might get hit. Yeah. It's the monsters' turn, and I made a mistake. Oh. The, la the last time. Uh, let me see. Let me go back up here where the goal's turn was the first time, because uh, for one of the claw attacks for Dezo, I'm supposed to take it off from, from wolf form and not her actual um, hit. So one might actually be pass? dead. Uh, that's both. Where are ya? Yep, the sap. Okay, yep. Yep, I gotta pay more attention to her to her wolf's um, health than her actual health. Oh, her HP. Okay, that's how you were talking about the save. Like, well, like, wait, so she wouldn't have passed? No, she still wouldn't have passed, but. While she's in her wolf form, the wolf form takes the hit instead of, um, her. Instead of her. Got it. Yep. So, depending on this attack, she might transform back. Crap. Oh, no. It has advantage. It does have yeah. advantage. And if because... it hits, it's a crit. Please miss, please miss, please miss. Thirteen to hit. Unfortunately, matches. Down. Oh. So it's a sixteen. Yep. So you see her change back. To her dragon. Ah, crap. She takes any leftover damage that the uh, yeah form didn't take. Oy. Which I don't think is much. That's a good thing. Uh, depending. Okay, and then we got the second ghoul, and he's gonna attack Ibilios again. Do it. <laughs> oh, f uh, Are you kidding no. me? I, no, I, gotta, no. I gotta take the first roll. Yeah, no, that's it's natural. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> How do they keep getting that 20s? It's the roll of the dice. Oh, it is a roll of the dice. Uh, Ten from my health, and then make another con save, right? Yeah, make a con save. Don't worry, guys. I'm one for three. <laughs> Do it. Don't jinx it. Did he oh, jinx it? Not twenty. Oh, okay, I was about to flipping say. Yep. So you're not paralyzed this time. Yay! I'll take that with a grain of salt, I guess. Okay. I do, um, 
if it's not entirely too late from when the first school attacked to Dezo, I want to use my reaction, if that's okay. Or is it too late? Um, I would say, yeah, you can use a reaction. Okay. Cool. Where even is it? Here it is. Uh, I'm choosing Rebuke the Violent. So that ghoul takes half of what Dezo was dealt as radiant damage. Which ghoul? This, this one? This one? Or I'm sorry. Your... The one that attacked Dezo. And I, I read wrong. It makes, needs to make a wisdom save. Wisdom save. Right. I highly doubt it's... That. And if it succeeds, mm. then it's only half. No, now it's one, equal. It, it it's equal to the, the damage it had dealt, so it would have taken. It's going to take sixteen. It'll take sixteen radiant damage. Oh gosh! And he did. He said. He's dead. He's dead. He's Jim. done. Skis. Death by not one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that needs to be a meme. No, that needs to be a shirt. Okay. No, that needs to be a shirt. Okay, so now it's Elijah's turn, and I'm gonna say that after seeing Dezo, uh, not Dezo, Eric and Quinn trip the traps, um, actually, um, just to be fair, I'm actually gonna roll for that. Okay, so yes, he sees where the trigger of the trap is, so he avoids it while when he's um, going up. Such nimble, much wow. Yeah. His... Well, we want nimble last time. Well, we weren't really looking for traps, so his movement will go to here. He'll call... Uh, his monkey has a bonus action. And he is going to... Where are ya? He's gonna try out his new longbow. Oh, please. Oh, please tell me he's gonna go... Boom, headshot. Unfortunately, it does not hit. Dang it. Oh, he called it the repeating longbow. Aww, I feel so honored. <laughs> but that will be his turn, uh, Vilios. Alright. <clears throat> so, I think my priority should honestly try and de not have Dezo be paralyzed, so even if it does cost an attack of opportunity, I'm gonna go five feet towards Dezo. It is gonna provoke attack of opportunity. Do it then. And to me, it misses. <laughs> uh, let's see, using a level two slot. I will cast Lesser Restoration. Alright. Ending her paralyzation. Dezo is unparalyzed. Yippee. And that was my action. Uh, Bonus action? I, I will take no other actions. I'll pass. Alright. Round eight. Gwen. And I'm just gonna move move right here. And if I move any further, I can't do my attack act, and that would be pretty stupid. Oh. Uh, right. Hang on, wait. You have an idea? Gwen, you got an idea? No, I was just saying it okay. wouldn't work. Alright, Dezo is up and she is pretty pissed. 
Uh, let me see if I have enough uh, movement to do this. Yes, she does. She's gonna go around this way to get flanking advantage. That is... Uh... Yeah, let's go view. Oh, crap. It was actually sent to the DM and she got a nat 20. Let's go! Kill the darn thing. Um, it is not dead yet. Not yet. He's pretty close to death, but not yet. Well, technically, wouldn't he be re-dead, considering he's already dead? Anyway, no. You're up. I'll uh, just keep it easy. Um... Uh... Just gonna smack him on the mace because of flanking advantage. Oh. Oh! Let's go! Oh, jeez. He's you... dead! He's dead! I, I pretty much just you... smashed yep. his head right into his shoulders. You, you, pretty much, you pretty much laid his head clang off. Decapitation! Decapitation! Decapitation. Decapitation. Na, 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 na. Okay, I'll oh. just say within the past few minutes. Okay, within the past few seconds, there have been two nat 20s back to back, but within the past six minutes, since the previous nat 20 at 6 30 p.m. my time, we've had three nat 20s back to back to back. I have a feeling we're wasting all our good luck. No, we're not. We're wasting it. Okay, we're wasting all the good luck on monsters. That's where our good luck needs to shine. All right. So, no, you still got some movement and uh, bonus action. What you gonna do? Um. Well, you know what? <laughs> well, in character, I'm. I know there's a risk, but um, but in character, I don't know about it. So, you know what? I'm going to move 10 feet over to this chest and I'm going to, ins at the very least, inspect it. All so right. Uh, All right, bro. Um, are you just going to open the chest or are you going to investigate? Investigate. All right, bro. Roll investigation. Oh, oh, that's a nine. Sorry, I I didn't. I forgot to turn off. So that that's counts. intimidation. Yeah, that's intimidation. Oh, so that's oh, the oh, wrong gosh, goal. on it. Sorry, my bad. You're gonna <laughs> intimidate a chest. I mean, God, if it was a... Oh! Back to back! Is a nat 20 for loser? <laughs> you get a nat 20. You get a nat 20. <laughs> that is it! That, that is it! No just getting all of our nat 20s. Give me some of those. <laughs> Okay, no, so with those rolls, uh, you detect nothing wrong with this chest. In fact, it's even unlocked. So you open it and okay. you find two regular healing potions and 50 gold. Nice! So, hold on. Let me, let me just uh, add the gold. No. Oh. Netflix is gonna beat me to the chest. Yes, I am because I kind of want to inspect it. If that was the good one, I want to know if this is either good or a mimic. Just a standard uh, potion of healing, right? Two standards of healing potion. Yep, uh, I'll get that from the. Uh... All right, so intern, while I take care of that. All right, Netflix. I'm going to chest number two, and I am inspecting this. So, yeah. investigation. <laughs> <laughs> you son of a bucket eating bulldog! Give me that that's 20 I freaking smashed my head into the chest. Smash your head into the chest that opens. <laughs> okay, I'm weak. So... That's good. <laughs> so, you can't detect anything with this chest. 
To you, it looks you like a, a plain wooden box. You know what, guys? Just... Yeah. Can't that be risky? Can't that be risky and just open it? You know what, Netflix? You know what, Soundwave? Sometimes you gotta think outside the box. I will take that joke. Can I just unlock it? <laughs> I just hope my thieves' tools are better. Uh, sure. Using thieves' tools. Like I said, they're better. <laughs> uh, okay, How's you it? use you use thieves' tool and you hear a click. Oh no. Good click or bad click? Mm hmm. I, I slowly, I slowly open it up. What is it? Um, you try to open the chest, but you can't move it. You accidentally locked it. What? <laughs> How does that happen? As a, free, as a free action, Ebola is just gonna clap. Same this, Quinn. Yeah, I'm not helping. Just that guy just puts away her these tools, and the, for the last ten feet of her movement, she just she just cries. Oh, <laughs> poor baby. Listen, <laughs> Miss Nefa, uh, crying is a free action. <laughs> A chest. These tools are supposed to be opening a chest. How the how in Ogma's name did I log that chest? I don't know. Soundwave, in all seriousness, I can't wait to tell the other people about this later. Same. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, what's the matter? Embarrassed? Yes. Okay, so Aerith uh, walks in with Zuri and sees a crying nephrite. <laughs> <laughs> I am an embarrassment to my class! And she kind of lets go of Zuri so Zuri can... I'm going to say Zuri uses his movement to fly towards uh, nephrite to comfort her. She... She hangs on to Zuri for comfort. She is an embarrassment to her class. <laughs> I was gonna say, I thought she would be an embarrassment to her kind. Two! Like, okay. For the reason why I chose to have health, I took inspiration from Jalamum Tanlael from Welcome to the Show. I am embarrassed. I am the embarrassment of him. He... Got every single chest unlocked with practically e with practically n no struggle, just pure ease. I well, love the chest. Well, there was that one time where a chest exploded. I still want a chest. How do I do that? Just I don't know. Cat just likes to mess with you. Thanks, Cat. <laughs> I need that reassuring. Eris, take me out of my misery. I have been an insult to an artificer. Uh, okay. So, Eris, Eris gonna use her bonus action to move up here and give Nephrite a hug. There, there. It's alright, it's alright. What? It could have been worse. I mean, you remember you set the tent on fire, right? <laughs> Wait, what did he say? Wait, what did he say? Remember you said the tent on fire? That was a reference to the very first session where I set my tent on fire. Oh. <laughs> How do you set your tent on fire? I was working on an enhancement for a family trinket and the enhancement kind of blew up. Okay, ouch. Yep, he will go over here for now. And just watch the, the scene unfold. Avelios! Uh, 
Uh huh. Let me look at my inventory real quick. I don't know. Honest to God, what I you, want here. You do not have a violin. I know what you're trying to do. You do not no, have a violin. No, nothing like that. Um, how much is the potion you can give back in health? Uh, sure. Yeah. Um, Null hand went off to you on his turn. Well, no, because I have four already. I was just asking. Okay, never mind. Of normal health? Yeah, potion of healing. Standard thing. Yep. Add 2d4 plus 2. 2d4 plus 2. And my current health is 43. Yeah, why not? As an action, I'll drink a potion of standard healing. Can I take that same amount of dice for psychic damage, please? <laughs> Are you suffering from that in real life right now? Uh, it doesn't take a psychic to know you have problems right now. Uh, Pat, you said plus two, right? Plus two, yes. Uh, nine. <laughs> I'll take it. As my movement, I will set five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. I'll move. You. I just yeah. scrolled down on the map. Just why? <laughs> and I'll pass the turn. Ah, oh, another freaking door. Yeah, okay, and, that and from and from uh, Vilios's uh, point of view. Oh, come on, come on, lighting, lighting, work with me here. No, that's shadow. I want light. Ah, oh, this will work. Oh. Interesting. Another way? Yep. So, Gwen. I'm gonna go over to that chest where she failed. <laughs> <laughs> please please right. unlock it. That would be the okay. highlight. You know what? Okay, you know what? come on, Give these me. tools. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> So you tried I to I again! Yes, you broke them! Oh, come on! Me. Oh. That, is, that is revenge for roasting me! When can I just say that's the second time this dungeon you've done that? <laughs> Give me a second. I'm getting some real dice. Give me a second. <laughs> can someone please fix my tools again? Aerith nods and says. I'm on. I'll be on it in a minute. <laughs> oh, I, am, I got dice. I got real dice because I am rolling myself freaking psychic damage every time y'all roast me about locking a chest. <laughs> Was that payback? Was that karma for what I did? Sound way. <laughs> I'm rolling it based off a of vicious mockery. <laughs> <laughs> well, that Sound is away. your movement in action, yeah. Quinn. What's your bonus action? Don't go and look in the other server. <laughs> Can I just try to punch yeah. the chest open? Uh, make a strength check. I hate you, game. <laughs> oh, oops. Yeah, that's safe, say. but I'll I'll count it. First for timing, I I'll count it. Um, you do manage to punch a hole in the wooden chest, only enough to make a hole. Are you kidding me? Who popped in? Oh, uh, it's Dragon. Dragon. Hey, you Dragon. Missed, you missed the shenanigans. A lot. 
I got here. How do I make a small hole just with a punch? Well, you're expecting to take it down an entire chest with a, with a single punch? That would have been at, the, at least in, like, the 18th in order to do that. <sighs> Join the club because... Okay, Dragon, you wanna you wanna you wanna quick um run down on what just happened before you came in? Sure. Okay, so team B, which was Nephrite, Dezo, Nal, and Avelios, came across three ghouls, just like we left off in the cliffhanger. We killed all three of them, while Team A, which was Alish, Aerith, and Quinn, tried to come at, come and meet back up with us. Null unlocked one of the chests, which contained two healing potions and fifty gold. I tried to, I tried to investigate the other chest, Nat one. I tried to use these tools to unlock it. I got a thirteen, but instead I lock it. So everybody's just trying their best to open up or at least unlock the second chest or cover Nephrite or look for another way out. I am internally screaming right now. Oh yeah, Quinn just broke his thieves tools again. I, I wanna... Let me just find the creature and get this over with. I'm gonna feed it to a bloody pope. Okay, there is not a lot Dezo can do, so. She will just go back down here with Avelios. No? So, I'm gonna move over here and I'm gonna try to get the lock off. Alright. Let's see how that fares. Drink check? Yep. Are you kidding me? Yeah, it's winning. Oh, just a 19. I said you have to be near the the 18, so he breaks he breaks the lock. And in the chest you find 75 gold. Are you kidding me? He gets both of them. Nope, we're gonna share that at the end of this entire thing, hopefully. Yeah, uh, but for the right Alright, I'll I'll just write that down a total of one hundred. Oh uh, uh let's use one twenty five. So There we go. On. Yep. I Let me just check how far that was. So, 20 feet, so I got uh, 10 you. more. Alright, so, so. So, I can go only as far as there, so that's a, that's it, end turn. Alright, Nephrite, are you done crying yet? I'm done, I'm done. I. All right, L. I just took six psychic damage from that entire thing because <laughs> I was rolling it based off of a level five caster for vicious mockery, which is two D four. 